What's up guys, GTA Gamer here, and in today's video I'm going to be showing you guys three tips and tricks, and actually they're pretty cool, and uh, this is uh, episode four, I will be doing more of these series, so let's get straight into it. Alright you guys, so the first tip I want to show you guys is how to actually get Molotovs, and you can't get Molotovs unless you have the special edition of GTA 5, so I'm going to show you guys how to do that right now. And um, so all you have to do for this is simply just go on your phone, call Meriwether, and once you call Meriwether, you're going to request an ammo drop. Once you do that, you simply just have to wait around 15 to 20 seconds, and uh, it's going to be a little small box, so so you just got to wait around for that. So as you can see, I'm just waiting here. And there you go, it's just a little box. You're going to walk towards the box like I am, and then you're just going to pick it up. Once you do that, you're going to see you have three Molotovs in the weapon wheel. And uh, me and my friend are just like freaking killing each other. And yeah guys, that's how you get the Molotovs. Alright guys, so the second tip I want to show you guys is actually how to get invincible, invincibility uh, from cops and online players. Now in order to do this, all you guys have to do is go on your pause menu. And then you're going to want to come to this location right here on the map. It's near downtown Vinewood where the limo spawns. And uh, it's in this little alleyway right here. Once you guys do that, just climb into this fence. It's fence. It's really easy. And basically, the cops are just now getting confused of where I am, and they can't shoot me right now. As you see, that cops trying to shoot me, and I'm not losing my health. So this is actually pretty cool. It's not really a glitch. And uh, and I don't know. Maybe you can get shot from the top. Like at, like when you get cops on you, there's there's helicopters. When you get five stars. And uh, so the top part of this uh, fence is not covered, so I don't know if you're going to get shot or not. But people can like just chuck a grenade in there, so watch out for that. But otherwise, it's actually pretty cool, and uh, you're invincible. Alright guys, so the last tip of the day I'm going to show you guys actually how to keep the Meriwether airstrike in your weapon wheel. And uh, for what you guys are going to want to do is simply just dial Meriwether on your phone. Go all the way down to airstrike. Once you guys have done that, just open up your weapon wheel. And go to your flare. Once you've done that, just simply just open up your interaction menu, and then you're just gonna want to kill yourself. Once you have killed yourself, then when you respawn, you're actually gonna see that you have your um, airstrike in your weapon wheel. And note that uh, the airstrike, uh, if you have in your that you have in your weapon wheel, you can't actually use that. Uh, you just gotta call another airstrike in so the the airstrike you have in your weapon wheel that's not actually uh, usable you can just throw it around do whatever you want but it's actually not gonna cause any explosions you just have to call Meriwether again so I just wanna tell you guys that alright guys I hope you guys enjoyed that video if you did please drop a like below and subscribe it really helps me out a lot and I hope you guys enjoyed the video <laughs> peace out <laughs>